right, folks, Bob McCarthy here for the 2017 Lowell Folk Festival. We're having a great time. There are so many interesting things to see today. How about Parrot? How you doing? You having a great time? Seeing all the people? Eating all the bird food? Your tummy's full? All right, let's check out more. What's going on here at Folk Fest? Okay, I just caught up one of the great mascots here from the Boston Bruins. You having a great time here today, brother? You seeing all the food? Right? No bit, no deer hunting today, right? Or bear hunting? No? Okay, you seen uh, a lot of, you listening to the music that's here? Having a great time, rocking and rolling. Let's do it, come on. Show me how you do it. There we go, there we go, there we go. All right, awesome. Folks, let's check out more here at Folk Fest. All right, I just caught up with Chester from the Cheetos. How you doing, brother, today? Having a great time, right? All right, we saw a lot of, you gotta watch out for the bear over there. There's a parrot, everything. There's a lot of different animals here. It's like Wild Kingdom here at the Lowell Folk Festival. We have a lot of great things happening here. You're gonna run into this guy if you come down here and have a great time. So let's go around and see if that's happening, right? We're gonna get one of those cars, right? We're gonna get one of the cars. All right, joining me right now is Pedro Trinidad and his daughter, Laura Lise. You guys are having a great time here at the Folk Fest? Awesome, been fun, food's been great, activities been awesome, yeah. So is this your first time here? No, born and raised in Lowell. I've been here every year. It's, it's just gotten better every time and larger. The crowds are getting bigger and it's it's fun. Always fun, man. So you tell everybody to come on down now. What is some of the music you like when you've been here? Uh, definitely uh, definitely some of the African music, really fun. Uh, the, the drums, amazing. Some of the Venezuelan music that they had as well. And the Peruvians as well, too, in the boarding house park. Awesome stuff, man. Wow, man, you really know your stuff. You are a veteran here I, uh, at the Folk Festival. Pedro, thank you very much for joining thank us. Thank you very much. Turn the food. Okay, folks, joining me right now is Scott Morris. He's doing some of the grilling here downtown on Merrimack Street. Scott, how's it going today, brother? Going great. It's starting to get busy. Now, Sun's is out. Is this your first time here? No, we've been, we've been doing this for four years now. Four years, yep. and you're having a great time? Yep, we sure are. It gets bigger and better every year. Yep, Lowell does a great job in the Folk Fest. It surely does. It's probably the greatest thing about Lowell Mass is the Folk Fest every year. It brings everybody together from all different states, towns, countries. Yep. They all come here to join the Folk Fest. Now, what do you got, what do you got cooking here today? Got hot dogs, hamburgers, and sausages. Wow, wow, that's and fantastic. And fried dough. And fried dough. My girlfriend loves fried dough, so it's good. Come on down here, get the fried dough. Scott's flipping the burgers. We got Damon over there. He's helping out. It's going great, man. Fried fried dough, Coming up. All right. This is so we can get Hang on, hang on. Hang on. All right, we just caught up right now with David and Felix of the All Star Lounge right here on Merrimack Street. Gentlemen, how are you enjoying today's Folk Fest? Excellent, excellent. Loving it. Loving every minute of it. This is our eighth year, seventh year out here, so we're loving it. You see all the great people? Good people, unbelievable atmosphere. It's great. The food? Delicious. Anywhere, anywhere you go, it's all good food around here. And you got some of your own music playing, right? Because you might not like the folk music at the All Star Lounge. You can hear. Here we go. Hey, that, that's what happens here. If you come down this area, the All Star Lounge, you're gonna have to get boogie with David and Felix. It's the only way, or you can't go past Merrimack Street. No, we're right in the middle. Smack Remember, all right. Yeah. Joining me right now is the birthday girl, Anne Marie, and her friend Jen. She's celebrating her 30th birthday here at the Folk Festival. Let me decide here. Oh, 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 we heard this is the place to be. Yeah. And you're like, let's come to Lowell because it's dangerous. And right? yeah, we gotta figure this out, right? Yeah. You're, you're Living on the edge, right? Always on the edge, edge. baby. <laughs> <laughs> All right, is your first time here, ladies? Yeah. To Lowell, no. But to the festival, yeah. To the festival. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, great. You're gonna go around? Yeah, where's the middle? Well, everywhere. You go down here, you take a left, you go around. It's the whole downtown of Lowell. Wow. So in left, you can go, when you go down here, you can go left, you can go right. It's all over the place. Awesome. We cool. took over the whole city. Woo! It's a takeover! Woo! Woo! Yeah! yeah. Watch out, it's Amory's oh, birthday! Oh, oh, Amory's birthday! Amory's birthday! Yeah! Uh -oh. <laughs> You're not old yet. I'm four, I just turned 40 in April, so she's not old yet. 
All right, folks, I'm here with Rick right now. Rick, how's it going today, man? These are great. All right. Beautiful folk fest. Yeah, is your first time here? Oh, no, I'm, I'm a townie. Okay. Maybe. All right, all right, awesome. So what you're doing here is very incredible. You got the hammer, you're doing some nail stuff here. This is very unique here at the Folk Festival. So why don't you tell some of the people what you're doing here? So um, my name is Rick Steck. I'm here with all of the mill number five people here on Merrimack Street. And uh, what I'm doing is I'm showing some of the many uh, procedures that we undertake uh, at the Red Antler organization, Red Antler Homesteading. Lots of people here in the city know us as Red Antler Apothecary, where we make old world crafted goods. Soap, candles, salves, herbal medicinal medicine, and heritage furniture. I make stuff the way that it would have been made 200 plus years ago. Uh, when this anvil was made. Wow. You know, this wow. this guy's, you know, was made in England before the Civil War. Right. And so what I'm doing is uh, we're going to take some uh, found railroad spikes. Okay. And we're going to make them into coat hooks, okay. which is going to go on this piece of live pine. Okay. So we'll have, through the source of the demo, we'll have this done. Okay. Uh, so it'll be sold at the end of uh, today. Awesome. Uh, but, like so many things in blacksmithing, you can plan and plan and plan. Uh, I forgot nails, so we're making some nails. Okay. And that's what I'm doing right now. All right. You always had a plan B, right? You gotta have a plan, plan B. B. Yeah. Always have a plan B. You know, a plan A fails out. So, so Rick's gonna, gonna show us what we do right here. So I'm gonna start right here. Okay. With this. So this is this is bituminous coal. Okay. This is not your typical house heating coal. You're gonna want to stay. Okay. I'm gonna stay away. Well, that one's got me on fire here. Just the fumes are a little can be a little bit gnarly. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this isn't good heating coal for your house okay because the fire is very centralized what that means is like this coal here is oh, oh, oh you just picked that up I'm how would it touch right there how did you pick that up if it's in that it's just it isn't hot wow. it's just hot right here wow that's, that's crazy just in this area you're crazy has anybody ever called you crazy no. i'm calling you crazy not right now to my face okay, not to your face okay well hey there's a I'm first one with the hammer all right like, i'm sorry the cauldron all right the cauldron of fire, right the, right of fire the hammer okay so, uh, Rick knows we're joking. In in this, yeah. in this like grapefruit sized yeah. fire, yeah. I can get in excess of twenty five hundred degrees. Wow. Like it gets real hot in there. Wow. wow. So I'm gonna need you to back up. Okay, I'm backing up. Back it up. Eyes on because safety. Matters. Okay. Yep. Let's get the safety matters. Always gonna bring your glasses with you when doing safety stuff. Hammer time. Wow. I've never heard that before. He's just going away at it right here, folks. Look at this. This is incredible. All right. So that'll be a nail blank. Wow. And so what we'll do next is, the great thing about working with the smaller stock is that it heats up really quickly. So with the bigger stuff, it's more involved. You gotta wait for a longer period of time. Don't do that at home. Don't try this um, at home. To soak in. But with the smaller stock, and especially when you start working it down, getting it really small like that, it heats up really How do you touch all this stuff without gloves on? I mean, this was just in the oh, heater. I'm, my hands are Are like, you superhuman or something? I can't even use touch screens on phones if like lick my finger. You have no feeling in your hands anymore. You lost them years ago? What is the secret? For the most part, yeah. Okay. Okay. yeah. Right. Practice. It's incredible. All right, so on the anvil, We've got a hardy. Okay. That's the hole, and hardy tools go in the hole. And okay. what that allows you to do is manipulate the. So the hammer comes down, the force, equal, equal and opposite reaction, right? Okay, yep. So what I'm doing is I'm just focusing that force. Wow. Look at that. A nail blank. Wow. And then I'll use these, drop that in there, and put a head on it. Wow. And what you end up with. Yep. I'm going to do the Julia Child. Yeah, that, this is like right the cooking here. show, exactly. What's the final product? We had it all planned out. And then wow, leave. look at that. Voila. Woo. Look at that, folks, right there. Check it out. The final product. He makes his own nails. Come on in. He's the original blacksmith right here. Low. Let's hear it for Rick. Come on, folks. Let's hear it for him. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much, Rick.
Been a pleasure. All I'll right. Be, I'll be here until five. He'll be here until five. Okay, folks, joining me right now is Dean Smith right here. He's rocking and rolling right here, Low Folk Festival. Dean, how's it going? Good, good, very good. Now, you are the unsung cowboy, right? You're the urban cowboy here today? I'm Elvis in this town. All right, awesome. How many years you've been here? Oh, I've been here all my life. I've lived 20 years in Colorado. Wow, that's incredible. How do you compare Colorado to here? Uh, that's, hard to that's hard to say. It's more laid back there, right? Yeah, more laid back. Yeah, yeah, more relaxed. I know. It's more uptight here in the city. You're really, rah! Yeah. But in Colorado, they're like, hey, man. Hey, hey, man. Hey, hey man. Hey. You got me? You got me, man? Give me the peace sign right here. Peace, love, right here, Low Folk Festival 2017. And you got Elvis the signal right here. Right, folks, I'm joined right now by the Forbes twins, Henry and Alex. These guys have been going all around enjoying Folk Fest. How are you like doing today, brother? Hey, it was awesome today, man. We had a lot of fun. We saw a lot of great food. We had some jambalaya earlier. Man, this is what the city's all about. Got a lot of uh, cool people around mixing together and having a blast. Alex, what do you think? I'll tell you what, last night was a good time, too. We're, we're getting ready for tonight, but last night was a good way to warm up. It was awesome. Drinking all night, Hi, having you some know, drinks, a great time, having man. a great time, yeah, and you're going to do it again tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah we, we were busting out some moves. I mean, I can't speak for him. He's not a good dancer, but I'll tell you what, I was... But you guys are twins. I was tearing it up. Yeah. Yeah. You guys share the same brain. Yeah, everything's identical except the dance moves. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. hey, that's a first. Everything is identical except for the dance moves. Yeah. Now, I never heard... Of, how come you don't share his dancing moves? I don't know. He, he's got a weird style about it. It's weird. It's kind of a dad dance, you know what I mean? Oh. I'm kind of more hip, you know? Yeah. I, I listen to the, the good stuff. He's kind of all over old the Old school. Yeah, you know, he doesn't really have much. He kind of goes to one move and one yeah. move only. But it works. It, it, works. Works. it, works. it works. works. But the woman still come over, right? Oh, all the time. Yeah, well then, hey, if you got the one move, it's all you need. It's all you need. The Forbes all Twins you. right here, Folk Fest. Mm -hmm.